Good morning, Olive Branch. Another cool start to your morning. About 52 degrees this morning as you get up. Cloudy skies. A little bit of drizzle in the air as that cool air tries to squeeze out any available moisture, and it's doing that. Drizzle from time to time. I think today's going to be mostly cloudy again. Cool and breezy with a north wind at 10 to 15 miles per hour, much like yesterday. I am hopeful that we'll get a few peaks of sun this afternoon that'll warm it up a little bit warmer than yesterday. My daytime high yesterday uh, was 56 degrees. Now the record book will put down the high 60, which occurred at midnight. But during the daylight yesterday, 56 was as warm as we could get. Sunshine returns on Monday. I believe that's going to happen. Slow warming temperatures after that. The sun will do a, a good number on temperatures and we'll be up slightly above normal for temperatures by the end of the week. And then another cold front. Looks like it may be moving through. Today's weather, though, I'm calling for mostly cloudy skies all day long. Now, you may see a peak of sun in the afternoon. I hope we do, and that'll warm us up a little bit. But here's the way I think it pans out. 9 a.m. today, cloudy, 58 degrees. Noon today, cloudy, 63 degrees. And at 5 p.m. this afternoon, still going to be mostly cloudy, 65. Now, that 65 is dependent upon a little bit of sunshine. If we don't get a little sunshine, then our high may struggle to, to pass 60 degrees today. Here is your uh, national map, satellite and radar. You see an awful lot of clouds all across the, the country. This really looks like a, a wintertime type uh, cloud scenario, but um, it's not quite yet, although it felt like it yesterday. Low pressure still off the coast of South Carolina, bringing in flooding rainfall to that area. Charleston, South Carolina recorded over 11 inches of rain just yesterday, so they may be approaching 20 inches or so with this system, and it's not out of here yet. The uh, <clears throat> low pressure still hangs out over the coast. Flash flooding concerns all across South Carolina today. By this time on Monday morning, low pressure moves slightly offshore, pulling the heavy rain potential away from them, and by Tuesday, uh, the threat is no longer there, but the damage is done. High pressure will be in control. Our next weather maker is way up here in the Dakotas, slowly making its way down here, and I think it'll be here Friday or Friday night or so. Here's the forecast for today. 10% chance of drizzle this morning with cloudy skies, winds from the north at 10 to 15 miles per hour. 67 will be our high if we get sunshine. Uh, if not, we'll be in the low 60s at best. Low tonight, 54. Partly cloudy on Monday. 78 will be the high temperature. Low will be 59. And then on Tuesday, we have mostly sunny skies, High temperature will be 83 degrees, low 62. Wednesday, mostly sunny, high 84, low 64. Thursday, 84 again with partly cloudy skies. Friday, the cold front is close enough to us to bring us a 20% chance of showers with a high of 82, low 63. And then Saturday, 20% chance of showers still. Partly cloudy skies, high 79, low 58. And that's uh, just about normal for this time of year. One uh, other Announcement I need to talk about, Public Safety Night Out is Monday evening at the City Park in the track area. City of Olive Branch Police Department invites everyone to the annual Public Safety Night Out. This is the third one. There will be free food, live music, games, and safety demonstrations. Weather for that should be nearly perfect with partly cloudy skies, temperatures in the low 70s. Thanks for watching. I'm meteorologist Sam Reichard. This has been your OBTVLive.com forecast.